Hello lovely people, welcome back. Thanks for returning. And I know a lot of you have missed my oil videos. So today I'm back with another oil video and it's none other than palm kernel oil. I'm going to show you two ways that I make my palm kernel oil at home. First is the clear palm kernel oil and second is the crude or black palm kernel oil. It's so quick, easy to make. So without further ado, just relax and let me take you through these simple steps on how to get the palm kernel oil, okay? So first, I have my palm kernel here ready. I'm going to crack the shells off and I'll get the palm kernel itself, the palm kernel nuts, and then I'll make the oil out of them, okay? And palm kernel nuts are here. They are nicely washed and clean. I'm going to blend them, okay? And we will continue from there, so keep watching and go nowhere. Okay, towards the end of the video, as always, I'll take you through some of the benefits of palm kernel oil. And I'm sure it will be helpful to you, so keep watching and go nowhere. It's so quick, easy. Okay, we will just be done with this so soon, so go nowhere and just get it done and dusted with me. All right? I'm done blending the kernel nuts, so I'm going to transfer it into a bowl. Yeah, just like this. Now I've added water to the blender to wash all the stuck kernel nuts from the blender. Yes. And for me, this part is totally optional. You don't need to do this. I'm going to leave this in warm area for about 8 to 10 hours to let it ferment before I continue from here, okay? Giving it time to ferment will just enhance or take the flavor to the next level, okay? It's totally optional and it's not compulsory. I'm back and I've poured it into a saucepan. I'm going to let this sit for a few minutes until all the water dries out and the oil in the palm kernel nuts settles on top of it, just like this. At this stage, the more the water dries out, the more we get the oil from the palm kernel chaff. So we're going to let it sit for a few more minutes so that we can extract enough oil from the palm kernel chaff. Yes, can you see that? I can already see trace of oil in the palm kernel chaff. Very soon, I'll turn off the heat and strain the oil out. I'm doing this at this stage because I don't want to lose all the nutrients in the palm kernel oil. Okay, however, some people will still wait until the palm kernel chaff turns brown or golden brown. But if you do that, it means you have just lost all the nutrients in the palm kernel oil. So I'm going to stop here and strain the oil out. Okay, I'm going to squeeze it out using a cloth. You can use chiffon cloth, nutmeg bag, or any other cloth you prefer. Palm kernel oil has so many benefits and it has zero cholesterol it contains vitamin a vitamin e and vitamin k it contains unsaturated fats and is also loaded with antioxidants family please don't forget to give your girl a big thumbs up if you are enjoying this video so far don't forget to comment on the video don't forget to share for others to see and don't forget to recommend this channel to friends and families who may also like my recipes you can now describe the chaff and then put the oil in a clean dry container and use it for your skin and hair you can also leave the chaff in the sun for the sun to help you extract more oil okay for your own use better still you can use the double boiling method to extract more oil from the palm kernel chaff
as you are pouring the oil into the container, make sure that the water underneath the oil does not sneak its way into the oil, okay, or else it will affect the lifespan of the oil. If it's your first time on this channel, you are warmly welcome. Please click on the subscribe button, click on the bell button to receive updates from me and to watch all of my videos. So finally, we are done with the first method. We are going straight away to the second method. It's also quick and easy. And it's all about how to make crude or black palm kernel oil. I have few of the palm kernel nuts left, so I'm going to pour them into the frying pan like I've just done. I'm going to roast them on a low to medium heat level until oil comes out. It's so quick as I've just mentioned. So quick and easy. Okay. And the more you roast, the more oil you get. Okay. So you're going to still keep roasting until we get at least enough oil from the palm kernel nuts. We have just begun. So we still have some more time to go to get enough oil. Can you see it's already producing the oil? It's just so quick, family, it's just so quick. And now the palm kernel nuts have already turned black. Before it was like brown or yeah, it was like dark brown or brown and now it's all totally black yes and this is how we make crude or black palm kernel oil it's also very good for the skin and hair you can use it to moisturize your hair it will help prevent hair damages it will help your hair grow faster and thicker it will also help prevent hair loss and breakages it's also used as hot oil treatments for dry hair and scalp so as to soothe and moisturize the hair. Palm kernel oil prevents aging. It helps to delay sagging and wrinkled skin. It helps to also detoxify the body. It has zero cholesterol. It contains vitamin A, vitamin E, and vitamin K. It contains unsaturated fats and is loaded with antioxidants. In this video today, I've shown you how to make palm kernel oil using the hot press method and I've shown you two ways. In my next video, I'm going to show you how to make palm kernel oil using the cold press method. So watch out. Coming this way, we end the video today and I hope you have been inspired. For more videos like this, please follow your girl on Instagram, like my Facebook page, follow me as well on Facebook, subscribe to my YouTube channel for us to build this amazing family together. Thank you all for watching. See you all again in my next video. Until then, stay blessed, stay safe. Kiss. Bye, y'all.